Santiago and Milagros for inviting me to Boston. Oh, sorry. What a great city. So much, cult it's so culturally rich. I really love it. I came to this country when I was three years old with my parents, four sisters, my uncles, aunts, 55 cousins, all on an American Airlines flight. <laughs> And um, I still fly American Airlines, I must say. So if there's any marketers out there, do know that we Latinos are extremely loyal. Um, I grew up in Boundbrook, New Jersey, in a melting pot with Italians, Irish, Poles. I spoke Spanish at home, English at school. I had my feet in two worlds, watching novelas, listening to ACDC and Led Zeppelin, um, El Gran Combo, Willy Colon, Earth, Wind and Fire. Que complejo! That was my America. In many ways, it's not a surprise that I ended up running a Latin marketing company. When I was a child, I was a translator for my mother and father at the bank, at school, at the doctor's office. Sometimes it was a direct translation. Sometimes it was a trans creation. Um, whatever it took to get the right message through. I started my career working in entertainment marketing for big companies like Sony and Arista Records, and I was one of very few women and, and, and marketing meetings and very few people of color in marketing meetings. And I want to tell you that during those meetings, I, I really witnessed um, some very ignorant comments. Um, and that experience really made me a strong and a better person today. And what I realized, it was actually a great opportunity for me because I said, wow, these people really have no idea what they're doing. And um, I'm going to help them understand the changing population that's America. And that is that, um, that we are here, we're Americans, we're Latinos or blacks or Asians, whatever you are, but America is a different color today. And um, so in 1997, I started my own company, American Entertainment Marketing, with the objective to help companies sell their products to the Latino community, but in a meaningful and respectful way without condescending to them. And my company has worked on big movies like Spider-Man and, and, and what else, Daddy Daycare, Scooby-Doo, Amor Espero y Tu Mamá También, Babel, Frida, some movies that you may have seen. I've been so fortunate to work um, firsthand with Robert Rodriguez, the Mexican-American filmmaker on the Spy Kids movies and Sin City, Once Upon a Time in Mexico, The Adventures of Shark Boy and Lava Girl, and so many more. I'm so grateful. Um, to my parents for bringing me to this country. I'm grateful for this country, for the great um, possibilities and um, the great um, opportunities that, that, that I have here in this country. And I really believe that all you have to do is, you know, pull up your sleeves and work hard. A little integrity and hard work will get you everywhere. Thank you so much for this award. God bless all of you.